This is my favorite one because I really like um, him here portrayed as a little boy on the horse and from what I remember the horse represents um, the loss of his son one of the tragedies in his life so and I love the bright colors of this um, and then it was painted in 2020 um, it's a beautiful painting and then it has his mother here too which I really like if I were a designer and what brand would I style him in? Um, as an artist from Little Rock, Arkansas, I shop at a local vintage shop um, called Crying Weasel, so I believe I would bring him there to style him. <laughs> I'm standing in front of the a Botero drawing, apparently charcoal. Uh, I usually see uh, oil paintings, but this is unusual for me to see a, an actual drawing. Uh, I see that he uses a lot of uh, curves, <laughs> a lot of curves, so not, not too many straight lines. Uh, the topic is the family, uh, including that big dog there. Botero's painting, Lovers Dance in the Nude, recreated who would be my partner. Um, my partner would be my future love of my life, wherever you are. Um, yeah, we would be dancing in the nude, happy as ever, and then, you know, living life, eating fruits, <laughs> all of that good stuff. This is one of my favorite um, art pieces by Botero. This is the, uh, the Botero horse. I, I really like his sculptures. Um, his sculptures are like very lively, very, even though most of them, or I think any of them, have any color, like they really give off liveliness. What I like about Botero's paintings, they don't per, um, show perfection, they don't show skinny, everything that's perfect. What I like about them, him, he shows pretty much the imperfections, reality, what's truly in real life. What I really like about this piece is actually the color composition. I notice a lot of greens and pinks, which you mentioned earlier, why did I think she had a pink towel? Um, I love how it matches the shower curtain and everything like that, even down to her toenails and her bath mat. All the color um, is what really stands out to me. What would you cook if you invited Botero to lunch? I would definitely cook him soup yeah definitely comfort food um i'm appreciating the sunflower painting um i feel like i would place it in uh, the kitchen area of my family's home um i feel like it brings very warm feelings the color that he uses the textures of um how big the flowers are